the morning, boys and girls of the YouTube world. Is I? Paw paw. Don't make you go over there. I'll go with Mitch on this kitty. Let's get a meringue do. So anyway, I am cutting some trees with Kitty. Trying to get her warmed up so she stops her emissions problem. Being spot every morning. It's about, it's about 15 or 20 minutes to get it up to a real good temperature and it stops this really rolling and derating thing. I guess that stupid EGR thing's all fucked up. I don't know. I hate to even think about it, but I guess that's what the problem is. I'm gonna get somebody to make some parts fall off of it. You don't know want to be wasting not on it. So, this is the nice stuff. I got the road right over here. You can see the wires and the grades, so I gotta watch what I'm doing here. A lot of these, what I'm doing is all different. I, I won't double cut them just to try to lean back on me and get me a little bit more. I'll tell you what I'm doing. Mean. I'll leave that little tab right here. Not too worried about it because the footage is probably going to be on the slab. It didn't hurt it anyway, but that way it gives you a nice, nice little hinge to work with, you know? You gotta kind of stop it where it wants to go, that's fine, and you just push it back. It's pretty accurate, like I said before, I'm pretty accurate on my estimates on height. You know, I'm coming with a couple of inches, so it's like I'm wasting a lot, you know. Look at the rocks over here. Look at these freaking rocks. Unbelievable. Certain areas in here, like rock section. Don't make it too bad. Tired guys, I'm not walking, I don't want to do something else, you know. I don't blame them, I always do. Alright, so this is kind of going to be a little something weird. Too much. Beautiful. This one. 
I'm gonna wipe out that stupid hemlock. The wires. <laughs> okay, it don't matter if it runs a little sideways on me because we'll just do this. It actually smashes. It makes a pretty good road. Before this down, it rains. It doesn't even. It doesn't even really get muddy in here. It's so well drained. Oh God. Yourself, huh? That's the beauty of this popper, isn't it? It's a little bit of 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 a Got a lot to do when you hunt this stuff. You don't know where the hell the rocks are. I had one yesterday. I had one yesterday. A rock was moving up the back side of the tree again. Didn't I just nail it? Obviously, I can't see it. You wouldn't have to see it unless you got out and look. There she was. Rock was leaning up again to the other end of this, you know, where the tree grew up out of the ground and did this with the rock, and I went around and saw it in there. Brand new chain. <laughs> Never failed. Put a new chain on and I put on it. You know, always. Boys, boys in the back land and are uh, kind of winding it down back here today. 
I'm alive without this. I'm gonna get, get the dump truck next. Okay? Dump truck. Dump truck last night. My old phone truck. So they're gonna try and get to the truck. Get some of the road stones this morning. Today. I'm gonna try and keep the truck busy. Mark is gonna die for some point. He's not gonna be trucking. Mark, he's got one load. The other guys are we're going to be trucking. Trucking. Look at the slow trucking days. Look back at the rest of the storm was done before it uh, rained. It looked like rain over the weekend. Look at that. So basically, I'm just going to cut this stuff in half, spin it around, and pull out that way. Like I said, we're only a few feet from landing, it really takes a minute to spin the stuff around. Take a little bit of a food away. Then you find yourself doing this a lot with this. With, uh, like cutting up across the front end, and especially this tall stuff. Fuck it in half, take a big skip. Not that it matters much in here because it's pretty much a whack, but. If you were in a piece where you were really worried about bumping residuals, you know, this wasn't nice, you know? Thank you. 